Here's a look at some toys that will be available for the 2024 holiday season. Welcome to the Shaw Report. There were two holiday toy showcases in New York City on September 17, 2024. Between Toys, Tots, Pets, and More, or TTPM, and the Toy Insider's Holiday of Play, overwhelming doesn't begin to describe the amount of information I got to see, I got to take in, and the toys I got to see. There were over 100 products to see and touch, all available either currently or as of November 2024. The Energizer Bunny might seem an unlikely mascot at these recent toy shows, but alkaline batteries are still a prominent necessity for many toys and play sets, so it was nice to see a large Energizer Bunny just drumming around the, um, the holiday of play there. First product we'll take a look at is the Real Effects Disney Stitch, which is available now from Wow Stuff Toys. The hand puppet of the Disney character has a plush body and a controllable head. The head's mouth moves, the eyes blink, and Stitch makes different sounds depending on how you interact with him. By the way, Real FX Stitch uses three AAA batteries. Ha! Huh. It's available on Amazon for $79.99. I got to try it out and it is quite animated. It's definitely fun for the puppet crowd. Up, now, up next, let's talk about the selection of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles available this year from Playmates Toys. For vintage reissue fans, the Pizza Thrower Turtle Assault Vehicle with the works is back, with figures sold separately. For modern fans of the Netflix show Tales of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the Mutation Station Mutant Maker playset is a new way to mix and match new characters. Do you want Michelangelo's body with Rocksteady's head? You can do that with the Mutation Station. Mutation Station is available at Target with the, pow with the Pizza Thrower reissue coming later in 2024. Well, it wouldn't be a toy show without some Lego sets, and this year the hits keep coming. For the first time, a Legend of Zelda Lego set is available. The Great Deku Tree from Ocarina of Time features several Link minifigures and a Master Sword in the Stone. It has a 2,500-piece count and a $300 price tag. Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas also has an official Lego diorama set now, featuring minifigures of characters like the Mayor, Santa Claus, Sally, and a special minifigure for Jack with longer legs. The set costs $200 and contains over 2,100 pieces. Lego Stationery Line is introducing the Creativity Set for Holiday 2024. The set includes three Lego markers, a Lego gel pen, some sticky notes, and a few Lego pieces to spark the creative mind. Finally, Lego Star Wars The Dark Falcon is sure to satisfy the Star Wars fans' craving. It's much more than just another Millennium Falcon built with different pieces. The set opens up to reveal an entirely different playable interior of the ship with six minifigures, including the debut of Darth Jar Jar Binks in Lego form. The Dark Falcon is 1,579 pieces, available now for $180. Finally, let's talk about what's coming up from Hasbro. There were so many toys and brands to choose from between Monopoly Go, Beyblade X, and the force and telling Darth Vader. Surprisingly, there's a new ride-on toy for Play-Doh. The pizza delivery scooter lets kids push along and deliver Play-Doh pizzas around the house. Build the pizza on the mini oven in the scooter's rear, then press it down and watch it spin as it comes out. Definitely one for the smallest of the small children. To celebrate the release of Transformers 1, Hasbro collaborated with Fluffy NYC to bring Optimus Prime and Megatron to the show in cotton candy form. Toys from the movie feature Transformers who change from vehicle to robot to battle-ready robot with a little spin of the arms. Join forces with the High Guards, take down the evil overlord, and reclaim Cybertron. Other toys include masks of Optimus Prime or B that transform into their respective characters. By the way, thank you to Rogers and Cohen and Hasbro for providing one such mask. Transformers 1 releases in theaters September 19th. The toys are available now, and uh, I recommend seeing the movie. There are so many toys and items that we saw, and there are so many more that are available, but what products would you like to see on the show? If you enjoyed this content, please give us a like and, a, and please like the video and subscribe to the Shaw Report YouTube channel. And please leave us a comment below on what you on what you like from our visit. I'll have more great content for you in the coming weeks. For the Shaw Report, I'm Herbert Shaw, and now you know.